the school was built in 1966 and uh, they started i mean with from grade 8 to grade 12 and it has been running from that time up to this year I'm just here to tell you guys that it is possible, black child. The yes. aviation, the industry is looking for a black young child. So by virtue of you being in your seat, the person that you are, you're already advantage for the programs that we're, we're running today. Because there is no black people in our industry today. There's very few of them. So what I'm trying to say to you guys is, don't look at this as something that's far-fetched. That's something that, you know, can't happen. If it happened to me, it might as well happen to, to you and to you and to you. Uh, I know this aviation is uh, the science of flying. And this is more, many, many careers. I know that aviation, it's, it's the, it's, a, it's when they are making like they are helicopters. When we want to fly helicopters and when we want to work to the airport or want to do something else, but it's something that has to do with airplanes. As the expo, I'm looking forward to learn more about aeronautics and engineering. The air show, I'm doing. I'm looking forward to seeing like many aircrafts and many pilots that will be there. that will inspire me as a, a learner who is at SQJ. Like. I also want to be a black human that will once go to the air and fly aeroplanes and aircrafts. The benefits of the kids attending the air show and this aviation expo is it will help them to know about the field and their interest in the field will also increase so that we'll get more black children into that field.